according to Mount Shamonte, the way, the truth, and the life. On February 9, 2022, the American prospect headlined that the U.S. Congress had appropriated $500 million, half a billion dollars, for negative news coverage of China in the American Competes Act, directing funding to the U.S. Agency for Global Media a U.S.-run foreign media service as well as local outlets and programs to train foreign journalists. Pero ano ang maririnig natin kay Lisa Hontiveros? In the formality of a congressional hearing, asking Tariana a leading question to confirm her Assumption and in window that it is China that is engaging in state funded disinformation. Ito po klaro klaro. Pinasa sa Kongreso ng Amerika, state sponsored information terrorism. Information terrorism. Pangalawa, on the Joint Project for Oil and Gas Exploration at Reed Bank, or Direct to Reef. Since Teddy Boy Loxin sabotaged these negotiations towards the end of the Duterte administration, we have not received information as to what stage this very crucial deal has reached under the Marcos administration. Ito po, klaro, klaro. Pinasa sa Kongreso ng Amerika, state-sponsored information terrorism, Tapos tatanong niya si Daniela about China. Kami itong kaya gustong gusto ng mga general. Pag-provoke yan sa South China Sea, dalawang rason. Una, they will be engaged in action. Bibili sa kanilang promotion. At pangalawa, magkakapera pa sila sa bulsa. Sudo journalists, I am happy that at least one of the pro-American uh, podcaster is showing signs that he is already taking the middle ground. Nakikita na siguro niya na pabagsak na si Bongbong Marcos at paangat na si Sara Duterte. Not by Sara Duterte's initiative, but because of the intellectual bankruptcy of the President's cousin, who is Speaker of the House of Representatives, provoking a political engagement ay wala pa namang eleksyon. If not for the corruption involved here, only an idiot believe that playing cat and mouse or what they call chicken in the South China Sea with the, South, with the China Coast Guard will result in anything productive. Is kinanong gawin niyo? Yang patent kayo dyan, isa lang ang pupuntahan, tumbang preso. At pag nangyari yun, ay kawawa naman ang masasakripisyong personel ng Coast Guard. 
Philippine Air Force or Philippine Navy dying for the United States of America interests. When Robert Padilla brought this commonsensical analysis out in a congressional hearing involving the Department of National Defense and the Philippine Coast Guard, trolls surfaced and massing in social media feasting on the Senator for weeks. Bakit po natin ang prueba ng dollars na kumakalat sa mga trolls. Kung papaano ginagamit ng isang bansa ang kanyang Coast Guard, yan ang definisyon ng nature ng Coast Guard, maritime protection and safety. But we do things differently in the Philippines, however. Our foreign policy depends on who sits in Malacanang. Our government is now even confused as to what our core interests are as a nation. Ano ba? Inflation ba o sovereignty? May kaaway ba tayo o wala? Ano ang unang papatay sa akin? Kudo? O isang manyaga? According to Mao Samonte, the way, the truth, and the life. Thank you.